Hello, hello, happy Wednesday. Hello, hello, I am in my car. Sorry I'm a little late for what I was going to do at 12.30, but here we are. So thank you so much for joining me. This is my weekly two minute skincare drill here to provide you with tips and tricks on how to achieve the best skin of your life. So today we're gonna to talk about a topic that is difficult to pronounce actually. It's called hyaluronic acid. So first we're going to say it appropriately because it is a difficult word to say. So here's how to think of it. Hi Al, so like the guy Al, hi Al, uronic. So it's just like that. Hi, Al. Uronic. And you can say it slowly or fast, um, but it's important, of course, to say it correctly. So we um, can definitely talk about it appropriately. But it's hyaluronic acid. And what it is, it is unlike other acids that we know about for skincare products like salicylic acid and glycolic acid. Those acids are typically used for the purpose of exfoliating away dead skin cells. Hyaluronic acid, on the other hand, is a much, much different substance. It is found naturally occurring. It's actually a polysaccharide, and it is found in tissues like our nerves and our joints and our eyes and our skin. And what it does in those areas is it attracts and holds onto water. In fact, it holds onto a thousand times its weight in water. So it is a very hydrating humectant, which is um, sort of a scientific term for something that holds onto water. Now, so why do we need to supplement it if we have it naturally occurring? Well, like many other things in life, after we age a bit, we lose the ability to produce it as much. So after we are 40, we are, our production of hyaluronic acid declines significantly. So adding hyaluronic acid to the tissues that are used to having that around, like our joints and our eyes, and specifically talking our skin, um, definitely helps with preventing the sagging and wrinkling that occurs from that dehydrated and um, no longer longer plump skin. So look for a product that has hyaluronic acid in it and um, sodium hyaluronate may be another form you might see which is perfectly fine as well. So again hyaluronic acid something you want definitely something you need to keep your skin looking great. I hope you found value in this and we will see you next week. Thank you so much.